nuclear apocalypse is terrifying enough, but what happens when something supernatural gets thrown into the mix? We're gonna find out. Fallout 4 is a game filled with places to see and things to do. The focus for this episode is the Dunwich Wars. When you arrive at the quarry, you'll have to handle the raiders inhabiting it. There's a decent amount of them, some of which have strange things to say. Guys don't bother me anymore. That's good. I think it's... What was that? Can't they read the signs? I think it's time I go back inside the quarry. It's been too long. No, I can't. The guys would never let me in. I could kill them all. No. No, that, would, that wouldn't be what it would want. It's time to lay down. Yes, of course. It's next to my bed. I will. It's loaded. Going down into the quarry, the rocks start shifting and are unstable. This is also mentioned in the station terminals. It's a drilling operation after all, so what would you expect? Things get interesting when the flashbacks begin. You witness workers, then more interesting, a group in what seems to be some sort of ritual. Hey Griswold. Throughout reading the terminals, you learn the station supervisors were sent to Station 4 by Team Schutz, who knew something about what was going on. Team Schutz here. No suspicions were raised when the new equipment was brought in the other day. Crew at Station 4 are still under the impression that we are setting up the new station beyond this area. The standing crew you hired are convincing enough. However, do worry about the project managers at the other stations, especially Bob at Station 1. We all know he takes his job very seriously. Bullet point updates bug the hell out of me. The cut tells me to figure out something's going on down here sooner rather than later. Please advise. Tim, good job on keeping things under wraps. I've taken your advice and have asked the other project managers to meet you at Station 4. Stall them if they arrive before we get there. They haven't been told anything. We are very close to accomplishing our goal. Please be patient. You will be rewarded in time. Once the flashback is over, you have to deal with the station supervisors who are now ghouls. After that, if you dive down in the water, you find what looks to be the top of a statue, going deeper, finding a pedestal with a strange dagger on it. What exactly was this company up to? What was the goal? Could the statue have had something to do with the tremors? Could the top of the statue in the excavation have something to do with the strange obelisk in the Dunwich building in Fallout 3, which in itself was a reference to a book by H.P. Lovecraft? So much mystery and lore. It makes Fallout a perfect game to do my series. I've been Mr. Shiny Keys. Thanks for watching.